Welcome to The Joy of Music, featuring Diane Bish. Today, bringing you a special presentation from the Ochsenhausen Monastery in southern Germany, a monument of faith. Now, Miss Diane Bish. Welcome to the Joy of Music. Today the program comes to you from the tiny village of Ochsenhausen. In the rolling countryside between Ulm and Lake Constance in southern Germany stands the little village of Ochsenhausen with its sparkling monastery of gold and white. The monastery dates back to the year 1093 and houses one of the most historic and famous organs in all of the world. Inscribed on the wall right under the organ are these words, Praise ye the Lord, praise him with stringed instruments and organs, let everything that hath breath praise the Lord. The Ochsenhausen Monastery, truly a monument of faith, is known as the Resurrection Church. It was founded in the year 1090, and the Great Church was started in the year 1490. All of the statue work and paintings reflect the glory and life of Christ, His birth, His passion and resurrection, and the glorious day He will return to earth. In John, it tells us of Christ coming to this earth. And the Word became flesh and dwelt among us, and we beheld his glory, the glory of the only begotten Son, full of grace and truth.
In the early 1700s, a man was born in Ochsenhausen named Joseph Gobbler. Gobbler wanted to be an organ builder, and the first organ he built was here in his hometown of Ochsenhausen in the monastery. It was such a success that he was asked to build the famous organ of the Weingarten Monastery and in many other churches of Germany. In order to reach the organ, one must go up many flights of stairs, then through the old attic of the church, up another flight of stairs, and then to the console, which faces the long nave of the church. Oxenhausen Monastery are scenes depicting the life of Christ, his passion, his crucifixion, and finally his glorious resurrection. He was wounded for our transgressions. He was bruised for our iniquities. Upon him was the chastisement that made us whole, and with his stripes we are healed.
For hundreds of years, the truth of the gospel has been preached and heard in the Ochsenhausen Monastery. The truth of the love and forgiveness of Jesus Christ toward those who will trust in him. This great historic truth is well reflected in a contemporary hymn, Turn Your Eyes Upon Jesus, and the things of this world will grow strangely dim. The Ochsenhausen Monastery is not only famous for its organ, but also for its many statues and paintings of well-known Bible characters. Behind me stands the high altar, and atop the high altar is the crucified Christ. But every tour that takes place in this monastery is reminded by the priest that Christ is no longer on the cross, but is the risen Christ. High above us on the ceiling are great golden rays. This is, he reminds us, the risen Lord.
Gelsenhausen Monastery is truly a monument of faith, a monument to the living God and the resurrected Christ. Crown him with many crowns, the Lamb upon his throne. Hark how the heavenly anthem drowns all music but its own. Awake my soul and sing of him who died for thee, and hail him as thy matchless king through all eternity. Across hundreds of years, the Ochsenhausen Monastery with its famous gobbler organ of red and gold casework has been used as a house of worship where thousands of people have come from around the world. Today we have heard great classical and sacred masterpieces from this ancient monastery. We pray that you have been blessed and enriched by the music today. Thank you for joining us. And we look forward to seeing you again next week on The Joy of Music. Thank you for joining us today on The Joy of Music. Diane Bisch and The Joy of Music wish to thank Lufthansa German Airlines for their support in making this program possible.